what up what up what up how's everybody doing today so today i'm gonna be going up to custer state park to a campground called game lodge and that was the only thing open that I could make reservations a lot of places are closed because it's winter time and it actually just snowed a couple days ago so i'm hoping the roads are plowed um i got my mattress finally double stacked so i'm hoping it's going to be more comfortable and not too squishy where you know i can't find a good spot to sleep in i don't know if you guys get that but uh yeah i brought some food from home for me to eat up there so i'll be heading out right now and i'll see you on the road made it here um, pretty stoked but it's lonely there's nobody here I think I'm the only person camping at this whole campground um, there are some people that I saw walking by but I think they just came from that uh, I think campground resort lodge right actually it's probably like maybe 400 feet from here I think they're actually walking through the campground there's a path so but this place is crazy. Um, you can tell we got the uh, river running through here. It's all the way through. So I'm definitely gonna eat something in a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna explore, get my jacket, and uh, just check the check out the area. Check out this old barn over here. Dear friend, hope springs eternal. I've been thinking about that a lot lately. I feel the gaze of winter looking for a place to rest, kindling the rosy rubber tramp in me. I find myself staring into nothing a lot, as the blank stares take shape of travel. I snap out of it with a smile every time. I know you're busy. But if you get a chance, lay your head under a tree and tell me what it says. I'll see you soon. Your friend, Joe. freaking cold out there the wind's starting to pick up all right so what i'm gonna have for dinner is actually ceviche my mom used to make this dish a lot and i would eat this for weeks and weeks so it's a seafood dish so i made this myself and uh yeah it's pretty good i added some i added some chili uh and some salt to it That was amazing. I could have ate a lot more. But now I'm gonna have a fizzy tea. It's a uh, strawberry cream herbal tea. No caffeine, 10 calories, two grams of sugar. Oh God. I don't know. Tastes kind of gross. I also forgot I brought some mangoes too, so. Mm. I love mangoes. It's probably one of my favorite fruits out there. Might as well get everything set up before um, it gets, before it gets done. Oh, oh, that's pretty comfortable. So this 
this is how I sleep. Uh, it's not bad. Also got my light. It's getting, it's getting pretty cold, so I'm definitely gonna be using the big sleeping bag, the zero degree bag, to keep me warm all night. All right, so it's not closed all the way, which kind of sucks, but um, yeah, um, I guess I'm gonna try to go to sleep. I'm gonna be on my phone for a little bit. Definitely creepy. I'm having second thoughts of staying here. I was in the front of my car in the pat in the driver's seat just thinking and thinking should I leave should I just drive down to Custer and you know stay at one of those um, truck stops or gas stations cuz yeah it's super creepy out here but I think I'll be fine uh, this spots a little better so Good morning. How's everybody doing out there? 6:38. Um, woke up. wasn't uh, Was pretty warm. Um, woke up a couple times during the night. Didn't get the best sleep. Um, the wind started howling down here at the campsite. Hearing strange noises. Um, yeah, it was pretty creepy. And I imagine if I would have stated that at my campsite, it would have been even creepier in the dark dark corner the last campsite in the corner next to that old building I saw a cat run in there too so that was creepy um but yeah it wasn't too bad it got cold didn't get too cold not where you know it didn't get so cold that my zero degree bag wasn't gonna work let me show you just defrosting my windows but you could tell the sun's gonna peek over that hill right there So, um, yeah, um, hopefully I'll have another video after this. Either I'll go stay at a campsite or I'm going to go boondocking again. Um, just trying to figure out whatever's open right now in wintertime. So, um, and also in May, I'll be flying out to Portland, Oregon, renting a Home Depot van and sleeping in it for two days on the Oregon coast. So that should be fun. Um, just checking places out. I'm going to stay at a campsite. I'm going to go check out, um, I think, Astoria. I'll check out a bunch of towns on the Oregon coast. Um, and go visit some places that I used to um, sleep at when I used to live in my van down there. So that's going to be fun. Then in September, I'm going to be taking a bike tour for, I think, five days or something like that um, on the California coast. And that should be fun. So definitely wait for that one as well. Um, but yeah, I want to thank um, all my subscribers, everybody who watches my videos. Um, thank you for all the support. And I'm hopefully going to hit a thousand subscribers by the end of this year. Um, but we'll see. So until next time, keep the adventure going. Mm -hmm.